how do I take it? Okay. I'm done though. Oh, you look good, lad. You look good. I ain't going Hey y'all, back in it again. I'm definitely adding that. No, you're not. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this has to do for me. I'm adding that. Okay. So I'm gonna start off with a micellar water and I'm just using that with a cotton bud. And then I'm gonna use Astral. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna make this a funny tutorial. You're gonna make this a funny tutorial. You're not keeping all of this. Huh? You're not keeping all of it. Oh. Nice. It's a proper person, isn't it? It's getting all over your face. I have to keep you moisturised. I'm gonna do to you, Milan, as well. <laughs> my oh my. Okay, just don't be surprised if I add stuff in it. It's like a massage. Okay, beautiful. So as for powder, I'm going to be baking her eyebrows and I'm going to be using the Laura Mercier translucent powder. Then I'm just going to be brushing out her eyebrows. Then I'll be using the NYX Micro Wiz. I've done it before. And I decided to use a gel because I wanted to set her eyebrows and I didn't have an eyebrow gel at the moment. So that's what I used. Um, and for those that want to know what gel I use, it's the Eco Styler gel. And it's just a green one. And I really make sure to pat down that product with the back of the Wiz um, pencil. Then I'll be concealing her eyebrows with Maybelline concealer in caramel. Then I'll be filling in her eyebrows with just some eyeliner I got from the hair shop. You can just get any black eyeliner. Uh, just wanted to fill it in a bit more. Using the same concealer I used under her eyebrows, I just used that as the base shade for her eyeshadow. I'm using the Boss Mood palette from Morphe and I use the shade Nude and Green with Envy. I saw this, I saw this on Twitter. <laughs> See, I'm bad tonight. Yeah, I saw this. Imagine me. I saw people say I would never shop again. Yeah, like, it's so mad. Messy. Sure, we could help it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Imagine being fired in your face. Yeah. That would be good. Now I'll be using the 317 Morphe brush um, to cut the crease and I'll be using the same concealer I used from Maybelline in the shade Caramel. Then I pretty much just cut that crease. Um, I'm going to try and make it as equal as possible. You guys will see how I do that.
for this eyeshadow look i really wanted it to pop out because my sister has really nice beautiful skin and i just wanted a bright color so i ended up picking a green shade in that palette and I use the green shade uh, called Electric Energy and Pop Star. And I pretty much just start off with the lighter shade, making sure to pat in that product. Then I use the shade Light of the Party. This basically, this shade basically went on top of the green eyeshadow just to make it more brighter. And I tried really blending that in more. Then I used the shade Stand Out. And I wanted to add a little eyeliner flick. So I used the shade Sparks Fly. Okay, look at okay. Wait, wait, wait. My eyes watery. It's okay. just gonna slide off, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I wanted her to have a dark eyeliner on her waterline, uh, which was kind of a struggle, but I tried. And what really made this um, what really made this cut crease pop was the gel liner, which I definitely recommend you guys get from Superdrug, and it is the gel liner from Collection. I just got the one in silver. So I just put her lashes on and everything will be linked in the description below in case you want to purchase some stuff. Eyebrows, no you're not. Eye makeup. The eyebrows. She's done oh, with the eye, eye makeup. makeup. <laughs> I was about to say where's the foundation? Fevin, I have a question. This one goes like that, but this one goes, goes like that. Does it? This side, it goes down. It doesn't go like Yeah, let me see the other side. Let me see the other side. And then the other side goes circle. And this goes cut through the circle. Yeah. Can you not see it? I like that one more. The wings like that. That I like that one more. Another one. You think? It's going to be hard to make everything look equal. Mm -hmm. It's got glitter all over her face. After wiping off any glitter that has fallen from the eyeshadow, um, I go in with foundation. I wanted um, eyeliner actually. Black? Yeah. Really? What? It's, I did ask me that song girl, my bitch. I mean, I asked her, can you help me like find some type of songs in it? But I've heard her play this absolutely dog poo. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Nothing to say. <laughs> Huh? Is that what you're saying? That's not what? It's a nice thing to say. Uh, obviously, dog pooed at me, but obviously, my ass. No offense, my What? No. Nothing. Oh my gosh, I think it's your. I don't know if it's your colour. No, what'd you say? Tiffin. Actually. Oh, that's not her. Nothing, color. nothing. I don't know. What do you think? That's not her colour. It's not bad, it's, it's a not tiny not shade color. lighter. I mean, I can add the This look is way better than what you done. The other time. Yeah. The other time you just took me for a joke. <laughs> we thought I was just a canvas to play on. <laughs> <laughs> I look so different. I want to know who he is. I want to know who he is. Yeah, look down, look down. Yeah, look, what do you think? Look down, no, look down. Look up. When you look down. Yeah. Oh, right, you need to do it under here. Yeah, it's not done. See, I'm talking about here to here. That's what I'm asking, that's my question. No, it's not. Yes, fine. Then I just go in with a wet sponge and just blend out all of that foundation. As for concealer, I just use that same foundation shade and mix it with my concealer shade to get um, a nice shade for her under eyes and anywhere else that needed to be extra blemished. And I really took time to try blending everything to make it look bleak as possible. Uh, 
as for bronzer i just went in with a revolution bronzer in the shade deep dark and i just tried to snatch all of the places i thought needed to be contoured and for highlight i went in with the james charles palette and used the shade so good which was a nice gold shade for her skin and which this was my favorite bit so it was her lips and uh, Meryn didn't like her lips um, because it, it was a bit overlined but I really liked the look of them so I basically just wiped them off with micellar water and ended up using the same eyeliner after lining that I went in with a Kiko liner in the shade 321 which was a nice brown shade and i wanted it to be more precise so i went in with um a eyeshadow then i used the 3d hydro lip gloss and i wanted to add a bit of lightness to her lips so then i used the soft matte lip cream in the shade london from nyx um, i wanted to add a few beauty spots for her so i just used the collection liquid liner and just added a few How do I take pictures like this? I mean... Wait. You look nice though. Oh! Um. Wait, wait, wait. You look so good. Thank you. So you do this. You're you gonna pick. <laughs> How do I take it? Okay. I'm done though. Oh, you look good, lad. You look good. I ain't gonna... <laughs> Up, yo, with a Ooh, my niggas are savage, ruthless. We got 30 to 100 rounds, too. 